Hey guys, D Mike here. Hello, and welcome back to another episode of The Legend of Zelda The Wind Waker HD. Last time we did some more side quests. We looked at our map really quick. And we played some miniature golf, a little putt putt. And we're gonna do just a just a kiss, a little kiss. That was for you viewers, a little kiss for you. Um just a little bit more, I promise. We're get, we're getting we're getting close to being done. First one's right here. This is Diamond Step Isle, I believe. This is our reward for beating off the battleship game in under 20 shots. Also, there's the ghost ship, which is not something we're going to be doing today. All right, so nope. Starting off the episode really well by hitting the wrong button. If you like hitting wrong buttons, consider liking the video, commenting, subscribing. All right. Nope, nope, stop, quit. Yeah, we will be doing said ghost sheep eventually. I hear you making your sounds, but I don't trust you. Please. Oh, thank Gordonus. Beautiful. This is treasure chart 20 something, I think. It's not part of the continuation anyway, but that's nice. We get a brand new heart container. We can take a peek at the ghost ship. We're not actually going to do anything with it. Hopefully we don't actually trigger it because I don't know what that does. But we do need to continue heading this way. Ooh, spooky. I'll be back. We are heading north for now. This is all part of the plan. Trust me. We have to be going this way anyway because... This is where the eventual continuation of the game is, plot-wise. But I wanted to make sure that we had bolstered up our resources, you know? All right, so there's a lot of uh, a lot of drones, government drones flying around here. As you can see, there's fire through the fire and the flames. That's preventing us from being able to get access to presumably a switch on top of that Nintendo Switch. On top of that pillar. So we will find a space to drop Link off and then we will scale that shaft. In just a second. Get out. Get out. Oh, this doesn't look good. And we will be precariously navigating this little island. I don't know where the where the bus stop is here, where the pickoff point is. Viewers, did you ever have your parents drop you off from school, maybe pick you up and then forget about you? I might have been traumatized by that a few times. Okay. My dad's a little forgetful. He was usually my ride. And, uh... Sometimes he was like, whoops, gonna forget about my child. That happened. Alright. So... This boy... He's hanging out. Hello, swordsman. It's true. <gasps> oh my gosh. Bum, 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 bum. Yeah, I don't know what that does. I'm assuming it's just another side quest. We don't have time for that. So, sorry. Maybe be better at horticulture. But we do need our... Oi, pear. There's only one way that we can get all the way up there. It's with a flock of seagulls. Who run so far away. Alright. So, we gotta be careful here, though. Because there are these... I think they're called... Kagaroks or Kangaroks? Kangaroks wouldn't make sense, because they're not... From down in there. Whoop! Excuse me, whoa! Just keep flying. Just keep swimming. Nope, stay away. Alright. I thought the fire for a second was where I was trying to go. Ooh, this is, there's a lot of them. There's a lot of them. There's a lot of them. Let's go. Okay. I, I, I don't think that was fair, honestly. Like, I, I did not... I did not touch that. This is like a Wingle trying to fight a bunch of Fearos. That's a Pokemon joke. 
I don't think that the hitbox honestly touched it, if I'm being completely honest. Alright. That's enough of that. I also love the face that Link makes when he's doing that. Am I on the wrong side of the chest? Sure am. Oh boy. Hooray! We did it! How do you feel? How do you feel, viewers? Do you feel pretty good about that? Alright, let's take a deep breath because that is the last of the official side quests that I'm going to do today. Yay! Insert applause sound effect. But do not worry, there's a little bit that we'll be doing once we get to our next destination. Which I have to think about where that is because it has been a hot minute since I played this. Um... We are headed to... Let me look at our map here. We need to be taking a peek at the Forest Haven, which is which of the... No. Thank you, game. I was not done. Back to the map. Stop. Stop it. I zoomed in and I didn't mean to. What is... Do I not have the... No, I don't have it on here, which is really frustrating. Uh, I was looking for the forest haven on my of my chart, but apparently I did not mark it, which is really cool. Um, so what we're going to be doing is heading to the next plot point. I guess that's a good way to put it. Um, we're not too far away. We're going to be going to the... Let me look at my notes. The Great Fish Isle. I'm not 100% sure where that is, but... I remember I wrote on my notes, Big Cloud. So... We need to go to... Let me check. I think it's here. Oh, the game I already notated it. I'm an idiot. I could have also just written, uh, go to the spot. But I didn't. However, you should be very thankful because we are... There it is. There's a big old cloud. Don't forget to save to the cloud. We have the, the swift sail, which has done very good at the Grammys. All right, here we go. More plot. Do you see it, you big dummy? Oh yeah, we are advancing the plot so good. We're gonna be meeting a fish friend today. How's that sound, viewers? Although I don't know technically if it's a fish. Maybe it's actually a whale. We are too late. Darn. I think it's awesome that they bring you here just to whisk you away to somewhere else. Jaboon! Where's your boy Jaboon? Oh! Don't call us that. Who is this? What is this? If I remember correctly, this is Quill? This is the messenger from Windfall and Outset. What a coincidence, we are, in fact. We read our minds. The work of the shadow in the Forsaken Fortress. Where that abode might be? <gasps> Outset Island! <gasps> oh my gosh. Not be able to see Jaboon, why? Is he pooping? <laughs> Sealed with a mighty stone slab. Not even the pirates could get it. Not even the butt pirates. Huh. Well, that's really inconvenient. Hmm. Some pirates on Windfall Island. Sounds like a good idea. Do we know any pirates viewers? That's right. Velu's got good taste. He called this island cursed. Yeah, no kidding. Looking a little cursed. I 
Okay. Well. I suppose that makes sense. Now, before we leave, though. Yes. I would imagine they do, or else he just made that all up for no reason. Thanks for that boat. All right, so there's actually a little bit, one tiny thing we can do here. Let's call this a side quest quest. Or a side side quest. That would probably make more sense. All right, first things first, I'm the realist. Let's go ahead and get out of the boat. It's a little bit of spirally land. Because there's a fun thing to get. You'll thank me for this later. You're seeing all the goodies. As much as I can do with my notes. I'm going to run up this spiral trick. I hear a Korok shaking their thing. Will you bring us some blah 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 water blah 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 blah? Okay. So, I need to... Uh... Blow the wind. Among other things. To the northwest. And this will give us the proper oomph we need. Along with our Deku Leaf. And now, recently filled up magic meter. Double. Oops. Still not figuring out the buttons. A billion episodes in. Alright, so we should be able to use this. Alright. So there should be... I think there's a little thing right here. A little chesty poo. And a boop. Look at that, viewers. That's sneaky. Sneaky, sneaky, sneaky. It's another piece of heart for you, though. We love that. We're doing so much more better. Good. I probably should have... Okay. I'm just going to swim to the boat. Hopefully we don't get murdered in the process. Wouldn't that be unfortunate? And we are going to do one more submarine, officially, before we go back to Windfall. Let's check our map, because we got the submarine chart. Alright, where is the submarine chart? There she is. Uh, it is the one... Two squares to the east. east. Alright, here we go. This is important. I mean, partially the reason why I'm doing this is to show you everything. The other reason is because I suck at this game and this will make me much more tolerable to listen to if I die less. So, think of it as a return on investment, viewers. Ooh, that music is very spooky. I do believe that the music is like permanently this way until we solve the shenanigans that are happening. Here you go, one more. I'm still pretty freaked out by those weird water pee hat things. I don't know what they are, but I don't like them. I don't like them. All right. Let's see if we can find that submarine. I really actually wasn't looking for it just now. Everything's real spooky. Viewers, I'm scaled. I'm really scaled. All right, we're fine. We will find that submarine. And hopefully get a goodie. If we don't find it, then we will move on. Ooh. Octorox. Big ones. I think that's it. Ahead, maybe? Hold on. We in the... We're in the, we're in the auto zone. Um... Isn't that where it said it was? Hold on. Wait a second. Yeah, we're in the we're in the right square for it. Oh, jeez. All right. Yeah, the turning radius on my swift sail ain't great. Oh, this is where we fought the giant octo before, if you remember. It's what got us the bonus magics. Doubled our magic. Bar. I think I was like talking about going to this one and then I just didn't. So here it is. 
should try to do these when you can. There's always some sort of a goodie. My goodies. And I love sharing my goodies with my viewers. Here we go. Another submarine. I don't know if they go off the map when you're done or not, but... Right on your buns, right on your buns. I'm smacking you right on your buns. Oh, boomeranged right in your face. How's that? How's that rang feel? <laughs> I don't think I've ever seen that animation before. That's kind of fun. Yeah, the boomerang's pretty sweet for stunning stuff. That's unfortunately all it's really good for in this game. Oh, we got more boys to deal with. Let's go. Oh, I didn't even use the. Oops. I'm supposed to be doing this first. I killed that guy without doing it. Also, I did not follow the prompt. I'm just kind of... I'm just freewheeling right now. Just making it up. Sweep it? Yeah, sweep it up. Alright. Okay. Oh, another one? Stop it. Game, okay, I don't have time for this. But this does get me... Okay, cool. Let's let me make amends for missing out on the... Are these called... Skull, skull something? I don't know. Also, I could have done like the cool little scoot parry, but I didn't. Ow! Why are you like this? Just because I'm hitting you does not mean you get to hit me back. Oops. A boomerang pretty useless without Z targeting. Noted. Alright, that's three moblins. I think that's enough. Okay, I feel good about that. Get one more goodie here. We will actually be going back to Windfall beyond this, I think, one more time, at least, because there was a handful of... Oh, I got three already? There was a handful of things that... Little side quests that I wanted to do that I didn't because the episode was running long last time we were there. And that's why I didn't have the one treasure chart, so I did miss out on... A treasure chart, and then that treasure chart getting us a heart piece, I think. So, oops. Alright. King of Red Lions is tweaking a little bit. What's the matter, Link? I'm tweaking over here. Okay. Where is Windfall Island? I don't remember. Alright, so we're going to go north. Let's do that. Hooray! Let's get the wind blowing. All right, everything is great. Music aside, let's kick it into high gear. Yeah, the swift sail is such a great quality of life thing. I don't think that it was really that big of a deal, but like, let's say for instance, like you're playing this game and this is the fastest you can go. When you're going through large stretches of the Great Sea, this would be pretty annoying, so being able to go however many times faster is pretty clutch. We like that. But this is going to be a pretty explodey episode, I have a feeling. Something we'll need. We're going to be... I like how Link just casually bumps into the Octorok. <gasps> Sorry! I didn't see you right there. Just gonna squeeze right past you. Alright, we are almost there, I think. I can see it on the horizon, although it is very dark. Do we remember Windfall Island? We've only been there twice. Home sweet home. Away from home. We need something to bust into that cave. Can you think of what it could be? Something a little bombastic. <gasps> the pirate ship. I wonder why they're here. To pillage? They will not be taking Jaboon's secret gem as long as we're on the case. Alright, so we're going to do a little bit of a sneaking mission, okay? A little bit of a... A little bit of a sneaky sneaky. Alright, so this is one area that we need to go to. Back 
in the first romp around Windfall, we played hide and go seek with some of the killer bees. One of them was hiding behind this area right here. This is the bomb shop. We're going to need those for our adventure, of course, as any good adventurer does, especially children. Bombs. Explosions are perfect for kids. Ooh. Okay. So that's not what I meant to do. Was not trying to fall off Windfall Island. Let's go ahead and reset. Also, we have a letter. We just got a letter. All right. I don't remember this being a thing, so I'm going to check it out. This is not on the script. Good evening. What is it? If you wish to be a true swordsman, find some knight's crests and return to me. Thanks. Oh, that was a waste. Oops. That's fine. No real shortage of cash in this game. And like I showed you, any glowing little circle around will net you 50. So if you're hard up, there you go. All right. I need that prompt. Thank you. I want to use a control stick because I love this face. Mm, I'm just going to sneak right past you. Oh, I love it. This is probably the best, the best animation for Link in the game. All right. Oh, don't fall. We need to find a way inside. And we can't go in the front because they're heckin' closed. So maybe we go in the back door. You know how much D Mike loves sliding in that back door. Oh. Who could it be? But our pirate friends. Who have unfortunately captured the bomb shop owner. What a bunch of turds. That's not nice. We gotta pay attention to this conversation. There's a little bit of dialogue here that's going to be incredibly important to continuing on our journey. Monopoly, I love that game. House rules only. Free parking. An outrageous price, what did he ask for? So here we go, this is important. Pay attention to this. That was smooth, like peanut butter. Hiding something back at outset, huh? I wonder what it is. Is it Jaboon? Yeah. Such wit, such cunning. How old is Tetra? I don't like the thought of that. Oh, but he's in love. Major concern. All right. Oh, I didn't even think Tetra was in here. Quit boot scoot goofing off, both of you. Get those bombs back to the ship pronto. We gotta go to outset. We'll be following you there, don't worry. Seems like Gonzo's tired of having his sea legs. Direct defiance of the captain of the ship. You're gonna be... Walking the plank, my friend. I'm not entirely sure what the bomb shop owner's haircut's supposed to be. I wonder if Tetra has an ulterior motive, viewers. What do you think? I guess Tetra is secretly on our side. I don't know. Alright, today's password. This is very important. Don't forget it. Chumily. Okay. Thankfully, it's in red font, so we won't forget. Remember that, viewers. It's important. no way we're going to be able to infiltrate a pirate ship without it, I don't think. If I had to guess. And get those bombs back. Let's talk to this guy. Just kidding. <laughs> you get a viewer, so you can't talk. 
Okay. So now that we know the password, we're going to be able to make our way onto the pirate ship. Get those bombs back so we can go find Jaboon! Jaboy Jaboon, here we go! Whee! Success. Alright. Where is the door? There she is. How do you treat a shark? A shark. Wow. Alright, I don't know if I need to do this uppercase or lowercase, but chummily, I've heard, is a pretty nice way to do it. That's a really good uh, dad joke. Okay, great. Apparently it is uppercase because why not do it twice? Unless I spelled it wrong. I do really like chum chum chummily. That looks right. Okay, it was uppercase. That's great game design. Who doesn't love that? I know I do. Let's go downstairs. This is such a good song. Oh, it's Nico. Yes, of course. You're alive. Of course we did, Nico. Of course we missed you. Oh, you big dummy. Alright, so this is like a little bit more of a... an advanced swinging puzzle. It shouldn't be too tough, but... then again, I am really dumb, so we're gonna find out. And we gotta do it within the time limit, of course. Hopefully we can do this in one shot. While Nico teases us from afar. Seems like a really strange transaction that Nico has the power to give us the bombs. Knowing that he is not really that far up the chain of command. Alright, so here we go. Let's go ahead and line ourselves up properly with the Next to the cords, let's go ahead and slide down. Go ahead and slide down. Go ahead and slide. Stop. Okay, go down a little bit. All right, never mind. Because the game does not want us to do that, and I also need to get going because I'm running out of time. Oof. I don't know if that counts. Can I jump up to this? No, I think I bamboozled myself. Great. I thought there was a way to slide down the rope, but. I must have done something wrong. Go ahead and reset. Weird that I didn't get this in one try. All right, we're gonna go ahead and wrap up today with this. So hopefully I don't screw this up again. Ooh. Let's see if I can maybe just not cheese myself and you come back. I need you. I need you so good. Ooh, come on. There we go. Hopefully they give you a generous amount of time because this is a lot. Ooh, I didn't think I was going to make it. Felt dangerously close. I don't know how... Ugh, that's really frustrating. You do have to... be lower on that rope, and I thought that there was a way to... slide down a little bit further onto the length, but... was not giving me the prompt to do so. I think maybe you just have to fully commit to... stopping your momentum? Maybe. No, maybe it's... How do I... Oh, you just you have to hold stop. Understood. Understood. Alright, so now that we have this extra information, which I wish I knew before, we can hopefully navigate. Yeah, that's a lot easier to do this way. I would have made it the first time. I think... Come on, game. Let's get a move on. 
Gotta hurry up. Come on, Link, swing! East coast or west coast, your choice. Alright, here we go. Oop, let's go a little bit higher up the rope. Alright, come on, go. Be nice if there was some sort of like an audio indicator of whether or not you made it in time. There we go. Pretty generous. You bet we did. We aren't. You're incredible. Viewers, you too. Okay, you're gonna give us the bombs, right? Okay, perfect. You're the bomb, Nico. Thanks, buddy. Just pretend you didn't see us do this. Okay. Wonderful. Hooray! We did it. 30, up to 30 bombs. We got a mighty cannon on our boat. That's exciting. Oh! I think we've been caught. Stupid Snoopy rock spying on us. Well, duh, we're working on it. Back off, Tetra. Yeah, whatever. Don't make fun of Nico like that. He's very smart. Uh-oh. The gig is up. Jig, gig? Okay, thanks game for basically just like feeding it to us. Find your boon tonight. Mmm. Seems like a challenge. Which is something that we will be doing next time. So thanks for watching everybody. I've been D Mike. This has been the Legend of Zelda the Wind Waker HD. We're gonna go pay our boy Jaboon a visit in the next episode. Thanks for watching everybody. I've been D Mike. This has been the Wind Waker HD, and I'll see you next time. Bye.